Hey everybody, and welcome to Plastic Nostalgic, where all toys are nostalgic, eventually. Now the other day I was walking around a local flea market, and I saw these Marvel Legends action figures, so I had to pick them up. We got Cyclops, from as the leader of the X-Men at one time, and we have the Black Panther, leader of the Avengers at one time or another. Two awesome X-Men, or two awesome Marvel characters that I can't wait to get open. Today we have a couple of Marvel Legends from the Marvel Comics fan group. We have the Uncanny X-Men's Cyclops. Here he is in that retro looking package. Always has that explosion like background there. Let's see what it says on the back. It has the little collector cards you can cut out if you feel like. And it says Cyclops fires optic blast through Ruby Quartz as leader of the X-Men Mutant Fighting Force. Pretty simple action figure. I've said before these Marvel Legends remind me of the Secret Wars action figures from when I was a kid. They're not quite the same, but very similar. Here is the Black Panther's packaging. Looks like he's leaping out. Going to get you. I had a number of his comic books when I was younger, but somehow they got misplaced. We also have the collector card you can cut out from this, and it says Black Panther, the king of Wakanda to no one must he answer stalking villains through the streets t'challa is black panther then it says the same thing in several languages here i'm not familiar with most of them but i gave you the english version so enough with that let's get into these things now the avengers had several leaders at one time or another, including Captain America and Iron Man. But Black Panther was also one of the leaders of the X-Men. I mean, the, uh, the Avengers. And he brings with him the knowledge of being the king of Wakanda and the leadership qualities involved in that. Here he is now. Let's get him out of this plastic coffin. Pretty nice action figure. With the lines on his gloves, it reminds me of the, the Kirby artwork from his early days. It has very simple articulation. It's, Hands do move, but just his shoulders and his hips. Has those lines in his boots. As you can see on the packaging here with the lines in his arms or on his hands. And here they are on his gloves. But looks like he could do a lot of sneaking around in this outfit. Just like a Black Panther. Meow. Okay, that's the leader of the Avengers. Let's check out the leader of the X-Men. Now, the first time I saw these guys, it was a reprint of that giant size X-Men. And we carried that comic book around everywhere until the cover fell off. But that was one exciting X-Men comic book. Here is the card back without him on it. Scott Summers, AKA Slim, but better known as Cyclops. Very competent leader of the X-Men. And although they had some different uniforms in their early days, this is the one I'm more familiar with the 
blue and yellow outfit with these oops swashbuckler looking boots he has on and those yellow gloves there is his ruby lens that covers his eyes and gives him the name Cyclops although I often wondered if he had regular glasses what they would call him he too has that simple articulation but he can also turn his hands which is a little better than the original Secret Wars figures from back in the day he doesn't come with any weapons, neither does T'Challa. But they have the similar hands to a lot of the characters in this series. So I'm sure they can hold on to whatever else weapon that I can find. And have some backpacks and those little holes in their backs. So here we have the Marvel Legends, Black Panther, and Cyclops. And they'll make a great addition to my Marvel Legends collection. That's growing every time I open these packages. Thanks for joining us here on Plastic Nostalgic, where all toys are nostalgic. Eventually, oh wait, this just in. Important news saying small parts may be generated, not for children under three. So, do not let children under three play with this because they can't chew their toys correctly. So be sure to join us again for some more unboxing of some soon-to-be nostalgic toys. Be sure to like and subscribe, and leave a comment down below. See you all next time.